Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm coming at you with a plant haul. However, first I'm gonna do like a little bit of like a taste test of the McDonald's mint chocolate chip frappe. So when I was out buying more plants, I went onto the McDonald's app because I thought, let's go like get something. Because like let's go get a cold drink. And my original thought was getting like the frozen strawberry lemonade, which I did get. I've currently got my towel like on the floor because they are dripping. Now I haven't tasted this yet, however, all of the like whipped cream has like melted because it is hot outside. I don't know how hot it said it was, but I feel like it's I'm pretty sure it's in like the 23. Like at least that was what was predicted. But let's taste it. I have changed it out for a metal straw rather than the paper one though. Mm. Mm. In a sense, this part makes me think of the um, like millionaire's frappe, like because it has like the chocolate bits in. Oh, oh. so nice. I do love a good like mint chocolate chip ice cream <sighs> and I've actually brought out like a dress. Now one, with one of the plants I'm just kind of going to show you the plant bare rooted because there wasn't enough soil in the pot so it's literally just all the soil has gone everywhere and also sorry about any barking you hear in the background that's my neighbour's dog. He barks at literally everything. The first plant I bought was from B&M and it was this Dracaena and I'm getting soil on me. Let's try and not get it on the drinks. It's this Dracaena. I'm pulling it back in the bag. It was, I have got soil everywhere. But I've got, so luckily I put the towel down now because all the soil has gone onto the towel. Also, this was my first time trying the mint, not the mint, the frozen strawberry lemonade, and oh, it's incredible. So yeah, I got that Dracaena, three pound fifty from B and M. It was like the last one, and obviously it was going to be like the runt of the litter, because it's literally not got any soil in. Now that wasn't the only plant I bought from B and M, because I also bought this like mini succulent at like two pounds, and it's a crustula and yeah it's got these like velvety sort of feeling leaves but yeah it's a succulent and yeah let's try and keep this alive however i did obviously only pay two pounds for it so i'm not as bothered if i kill it but i would still be bothered if i killed it you get what i mean and then the final plant i bought was from lidl and it's this peperomia i'm not too sure what type of peperomia but it's got these lovely big leaves in fact their leaves remind me a little bit of my pilea peperomioides or chinese money plant and you'll understand in a second like the sort of patterning on like the leaves is similar obviously the leaves on this peperomia are a lot bigger and we've lost a leaf but it was kind of to be expected because honestly it just like transporting it home in a bag not the best idea but yeah like you lose a leaf it's not one of the big ones though luckily but I'll sort of need to have a look around in this for any like pests and also to make sure that it's like not like got any like caging around like the roots and all of that but really really nice I f if this if this leaf is like healthy then it has like this bubbling effect 
but I'm not sure. Like, it could be, like, the really mature leaves, but, again, I'm not too sure. And, yeah. So I need to look around that. But I need to sort out my Dracaena. But, yeah. Those are the few plants I bought. Today was payday. Those are the few plants that I've bought. I think the Dracaena is going to be left in the bag for now. Might be best. And, yeah. Like, there might be the odd bit of damage on the bottom of, like, one leaf. But it looks healthy. Like, I think out of all of the ones that I saw, like, this looks like the healthiest. And it's got this nice sort of like wood type effect like plant pot what does it say on the bottom oh it doesn't it's just the thing like the barcode but yeah it just says it's a peperomia and i'll have to go onto my like onto the facebook like plant group as to what specific type it is but I paid six pounds, well, five ninety nine in total, which is like really, really good for like a plant. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was definitely messy. I will sort of say that, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to smash a massive thumbs up, and don't forget to watch another one of my videos before you leave. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.